Hello coders, welcome back to our channel. Today we are going to see the amazing tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to see how to install the Vue plus React and how to configure the Tailwind CSS in your project. Let's move on. Just copy the steps. What I do first, create a new folder, name it Vue install. Yeah, after going to VS Code, open the terminal, new terminal, after opening, just copy the command what I do, npm create, view, latest, I am going to install the latest version, so latest, latest, yeah. You can give your project name here. My project. My project. If you are willing to install the directly, you are going to install the framework React. You can use this command template React. If you are going to install the React here, otherwise, you are willing to give an angular you can make an angular vanilla what framework you are willing to do you can just enter it will have ask a permission for you what what the framework you are willing to choose i'm going to choose react yeah what the language you are going to choose i'm going to choose javascript yeah just copy these comments and paste it now the npm we are installing let's see the react will take some time some minutes for installing all the package but view it a few seconds only you can easily make an folder with this and start your project by building faster and more config Yeah, the npm folder we are installing. Let's wait. Before going to use Tailwind, move to the extension, use the install this package Tailwind, install this. My net is very slow. Yeah, you can install this extension. It's very useful for auto complete your code and it will give you a suggestion for you to work faster. And if you are willing, if you are going to use React, install this extension React. Yes, yes, sir. And this is an amazing extension which is very useful for uh, React developers. Yeah, our npm were installed. Now let's start the server. The local server installed. Let's copy. Our React View plus React were installed, it is working functionally. In this, we can so we can change this, remove the unnecessary files. Yeah. The next view, yeah. Now we are going to configure the Tailwind CSS with your project. Let's open your browser and type for your. Sorry, 
mute tailwind css this is a tailwind css official website you can install it yeah before installing view you can use this command where i first used this and if you are going to install only tailwind css use this command just copy it and Control plus C. Sorry. Copy again. Paste here. Wait a few seconds. Our Pelvin CSS package are installing. Yeah, the Tailwind config going to install here. Yeah, in this config, we want to make some changes. Let's copy this two lines and paste in it. Yeah, and once more. Yeah. Just copy it and paste in the index.css. Index.css. Remove all thing and paste here. Yeah, almost done. Your tailwind CSS were complete. You can use here class name. Yeah. They are auto servicing for me. Let's install. This auto session come from the Tailwind config extension and the codium where I already installed. It is an AI assistant to auto complete your code, which is very useful. If you are willing to do it, I already posted in video, you can refer it. Yeah. Let's check the site. Let's check. Dm brand yeah. let's check now yeah the code were underlined let's make some changes test color we can change this color blue some yeah, the relevant CSS are configured and it is working functionally. Today, we video is over. If you are willing to ask anything, you can make in comment. Are you willing to learn anything new? You can post that in comment. I will go through and post a video for you. Thank you for watching, guys. Let's meet in the next video. Thank you.